Recently, I have been inundated on TikTok and YouTube with content from cozy influencers. The lifestyle is very aesthetic and inviting and, well, cozy. And I went in on it. <laughs> so I thought, why not try being a cozy influencer for a day? I have done an extensive amount of research, AKA watching a lot of TikToks and YouTube videos on the cozy lifestyle, as well as reading some articles from cozy influencers. Some of my favorite ones I watch all the time are Cozy K on YouTube and someone called Iona on YouTube who does mostly video games. So I'm definitely gonna look to Iona for what games I should play because part of this lifestyle is playing games. But Cozy K does some more day in the life of a cozy influencer type of videos. So I'll probably follow her suggestions when it comes to my entire day. I did find an article on how to dress cozy, so that will be part of it. I'm also definitely gonna need to go shopping because the cozy decor is really what brings you into that world. So my filming space needs to be a little more cozy than what I have going on back here. Obviously. There are tons of different cozy setups, but most of the ones I've found have earth tones, plants, mushrooms, fairies, plushies, pumpkins, neon signs, and the computer is always also somehow aesthetic with like the background. As far as activities go, it seems like shopping for this decor is an activity they do a lot, as well as playing on the Nintendo Switch, drinking cocoa, lighting a candle, reading, coloring, baking, just any kind of crafts, and there's always cats in it. But luckily I have three cats, so that should not be an issue there. Okay, now that I've done my research, I'm gonna order a couple of items online that I still need, go to the grocery store, and I will start my day once I have it all. Okay, good morning. It is officially the start of Cozy Day, and I'm about to head to Home Goods to do some decor shopping. But before I do all that, I have to show you the cozy outfit. Okay, they said to go with some kind of wool top. So I have this one that's really thick from Urban Outfitters and I matched it with this wool hat. I just thought it went together and my hair definitely needed a hat today. Um, I'm wearing these pants from American Eagle and shoes are banned. And I'm wearing this tote bag with it. They said to wear sweatpants. I don't have them, but these pants are actually super comfy. So now let's head to the car and see what decor we can find. The only issue with this outfit is even though it is November, I live in LA and it is currently 75 degrees. I feel like these colors are what I'm going for. Like this. Okay, just got done at Home Goods and Michaels. It's almost not worth going to Home Goods just because of the line, even at 10 a.m. But now I'm on the way to get cozy drink number one. Can I get an iced gingerbread oat milk chai? Whoa, that's so good. Okay, let me do a little haul. So I found these cute little mushroom things. I feel like mushrooms are very in with the cozy. Found those at Home Goods. Oh, and I also got this very yummy smelling apple honey butter candle I'm gonna light. I got two sets of fairy lights and this big long strand of like flowers and leaves. I also have these squishmallows that I've had for a while. I think they go good with the aesthetic as well as these pumpkins. I think I got these at Home Goods, but like two years ago. Okay, let's get decorating. This looks so good. I love how it turned out. Got all these little details here. I actually have this very aesthetic keyboard already and I love that. Um, I also found this really cool cozy wallpaper. It's like an animated wallpaper that I love. Um, the mushrooms definitely give it a good touch. Let me put that one like right there. And gotta have the switch. Okay, now that I got that all set up, I have a little bit of work to do so I'm gonna just do it and enjoy my new cozy space. Okay, 
Okay, I got a lot of work done and the next activity we're gonna be doing is baking cinnamon rolls. So Travis is behind me getting, honestly doing most of the prep work for me and we're about to begin. Cozy outfit is definitely making me pretty hot after doing all that baking. Now we have to let it rise. So I'm thinking I'm gonna do a couple of things like do some coloring, reading, and then get back to the baking. Here is the final page colored. I've got my blanket and my hot chocolate in this adorable little mug. I think that is like the definition of cozy. And cedar is really wanting to be cozy right now too. So I think I'm just gonna light the candle and <laughs> cuddle up with a book and this little monster. Okay, had to take a break from reading because the cinnamon rolls were ready to go in the oven. It's been about an hour and I would say they've definitely doubled in size. So now it's time to put them into the oven. And now it's time to make the cream cheese icing so that I have it ready when they come out. Okay, there's more cat content in this than I thought there was gonna be. But um, while that bakes, I finished the icing up and now I'm gonna show you a little island tour of my Animal Crossing Island. I was one of the people that during the pandemic played Animal Crossing nonstop. I love my island, but I don't think I've touched a thing on it. It's probably a year at least. I definitely don't have time to show you all of it, but I'm gonna show you my favorite parts of the island. All right, here is my little island. And walk right ahead, and there's a town hall. This isn't just an overview of my island. And <laughs> I have to say, it's a little insane how much terraforming I did back in the pandemic days. This was my favorite thing that I did. It was the first thing I did when I could terraform. I added this little coffee shop here and with the little river and the waterfall. My favorite thing, I've never seen anybody else do this, but I basically from scratch made a little tiki bar. So if you look up here, it says we're open. We got the drinks at the bar and the flooring with the neon palm trees. I just love this part of the island. And then another part that I just thought I was so creative for making was this putt-putt course. So there's like the golf bag and you get your little pen and paper and then it is a full nine hole putt-putt course. Obviously you can't play it, but I just thought this was so fun. And last but definitely not least, 
is my museum. I made that sign right there. I just love this dig site. So it's like we're digging for new dinosaurs. I have the T-Rex over here. And of course you can camp out while you are digging. Oh, it looks like the cinnamon rolls are done. crystals and crystal is going to teach me today how to do a little crocheting so i'm excited i've never done any kind of knitting or crocheting at all before so i'm excited so grab this tail and put it under your little pinky like that yeah and then turn your hand around and then grab your Point your finger and hook it and go like that. <laughs> it's kind of looking hard. It is hard. <laughs> it's easy, but it's hard. It's hard to, once you like when you start. Okay. Um, now you're gonna yarn over this this tape. You're working yarn. Yarn over it like this. We finally finished. This is my little dude. Crystal used the bigger yarn. I ended up going with the smaller one because I could not tell what I was doing. <laughs> but it was actually really fun. It did take what? It took like two hours. No more. Three? Almost three hours. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I would do it again. Yeah, that's fine. Now I'm gonna go home and play Switch. I did look at some recommendations from Iona and she recommended this one called Eastward. So I think we're gonna do that and unwind. Okay, my day is finally almost over. I've got some ambient music playing in the background. I downloaded Eastward. Now I'm gonna cozy up with some tea in my pajamas and play Switch for the rest of the night. And that should be the completion of my cozy day. Right, and that was my day as a cozy influencer. It was actually kind of exhausting <laughs> because I did so much and filmed all of it, but it was really fun. I think there's definitely something to say about just kind of doing mindless things that are just purely for fun. Like, I don't know when the last time I just colored or did a craft was, and it was actually a lot of fun. I think I will definitely take crocheting past this. I wanna try some more. Um, once I got the hang of it, it was actually very relaxing. I for sure see the appeal of the cozy lifestyle and I think I will definitely be implementing some of these things into my daily routine. Now I'm off to edit this video, but I'm happy that I have a cozy new environment to do it in. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and subscribe and like the video. I also want to do some other videos like this where I try being XYZ for a day. So let me know in the comments if you have any ideas for that. And otherwise I will see you in the next one.